Water Water Supercoolant is one of the best-selling products that Redline engineers. It helps vehicles perform better by reducing coolant temperatures by as much as 30 degrees. So how does Water Water make water wetter? First, let's take a look at your cooling system. Your vehicle generates power through combustion, the burning of air and fuel. In addition to the power your car generates, combustion also generates a tremendous amount of heat. Your cooling system flows a mixture of water and antifreeze through your engine and radiator to transfer excess heat away from the engine to keep it operating within a normal temperature range. As the fluid goes through your radiator, that heat is finally released to the atmosphere. As temperature builds inside your engine, hot spots form. Since water has a high surface tension, these hot spots cause the water to form vapor bubbles. The bubbles reduce the surface area between the water and the engine. The less surface area there is, the less area the heat has to transfer from the engine to the water. So these vapor bubbles reduce the effectiveness of your cooling system. Redline Water Wetter is engineered to reduce the surface tension of water, in turn reducing the size of the bubbles that form around these hot spots. By reducing the size of the bubbles, Water wetter increases the effective surface area of the water under high temperatures and increases the water's ability to transfer heat. Water wetter not only doubles the wetting ability of water in modern cooling systems, it also reduces rust, corrosion, and electrolysis, provides long-term corrosion protection, cleans and lubricates water pump seals, prevents foaming, reduces cavitation, binds with hard water to reduce scaling. Water is the best heat transfer agent in your cooling system, far superior to glycol-based coolant. For this reason, race cars use only water in their cooling systems. The addition of redline water wetter in a race car will not only improve the cooling system's ability to reduce engine temperatures, the anti-corrosive properties of water wetter will also help prevent corrosion, as well as provide the lubrication your water pump needs to operate properly. Dynamometer tests show significant improvements in cooling temperatures using water water. These tests were performed with a cast iron small block Chevy with aluminum cylinder heads and a 160 degree thermostat. The engine operated at 7200 RPM for three hours and the stabilized cooling temperature was recorded and tabulated. Cooling system fluid stabilized temperature, 50% glycol, 50% water, 228 degrees. 50-50 with water wetter, 220 degrees. Water alone, 220 degrees. Water with water wetter, 202 degrees. These numbers are similar to the temperatures seen under race conditions or heavy-duty street use. The bottom line, redline water wetter is a low-cost way to immediately reduce your engine's operating temperature and increase the life of your engine and cooling system.